What's going on YouTube, Geosna right here. In today's video we have a bit of an unexpected release, a TFP0 kernel exploit for iOS 13.3 and lower, including for the A12 and A13 devices has been released by Ben Nazad much much earlier than we thought and now we can finally update the uncover. But before we get right into the news I would definitely advise you to go on the Jailbreak Central forum that I created so that you can stay updated with the latest news and also you can request help in here. This is my forum and I will be available here a lot of the times. So so check it out in the description down below. But as you probably know, a couple of days ago, Brendan Azad posted, quote, if you're interested in bootstrapping iOS kernel security research on A13, keep an iPhone 11 on iOS 13.3. I will be releasing a proof of concept exploit that provides kernel read and write on iPhone 12.3 17C54. Well, that was that, and Pawn to Own announced the fact that he will be updating the uncovered jailbreak once that exploit is out. But we did not know when the release will take place, because usually Google Project Zero, of which Brenner Zed is a part of, take 90 days before they release anything. Well, just a few minutes ago, Brendan Zed surprised everybody with a release. He posted, quote, OOB timestamp is a proof of concept research exploit that exports the kernel task port or TFP0 on iOS 13.3.17 C54 on the iPhone 12.3. See the README and OOB timestamp.c for details. So this was posted five minutes ago at the time I'm making this video. So I got right on it. And as you can see here on the Google Project Zero, they did indeed post it. It's a bug for both iOS and macOS, but the macOS part of it is not exactly very interesting because, well, it's macOS. However, for the iOS, this can be used for the uncover and we can finally updated so that it no longer works only on 12.4 or 12.4.1 and we will have a complete iOS 13.3, 13.2, 13.1, 13.0 13 and so on jailbreak on the A12 and A13 devices, for example the iPhone XS, XS Max, XR and the iPhone 11 and 11 Pro as well as the rest of the devices like the iPhone 10, iPhone 7, 8 and so on. So yeah, Brennan released the TFP0 exploit much earlier than we thought and at this point Pont own can start working on the jailbreak and as you probably know, iOS 13.3 is currently still signed, so this is actually quite great. And iOS 13.3.1 is indeed available, so iOS 13.3 will likely not stay signed for so long, I would definitely save my blobs right now. And of course you can use TSS Saver for that, I have plenty of tutorials on the channel on how to save blobs. But anyways, the exploit is available and it's real, it has been released in here. You can see here that the uh, files are already available and apparently Brennan said that we should definitely check the O timestamp.c which basically contains the exploit itself and some more details however Brandon said that the exploit needs some tuning before it can work in the posting here on Google Project Zero he said quote in its current form the exploit is designed not to work generically it needs to be tuned to the specific research device on which it will run see the OOB timestamp readme for description on how to perform this tuning I may release a more complete exploit at a later date so this is actually a very early form of this exploit and we might get a much better one with, you know, more device support and stuff like that in the future. But this is already much earlier than we expected, because we expected Brandon to release the exploit in about 3 months, or 90 days, as is the policy of the Google Project Zero. However, apparently this happened much faster, and this is basically the code, and it can be plugged into the Uncover. So this is actually quite great, now we have all it takes to update the Uncover jailbreak for the iOS 13.3 and lower, including for the iPhone 11, 11 Pro, iPhone XS, XS Max, and R and all the rest of the devices supported by the check rain. So this is definitely quite nice. I really can't wait to announce on the channel that the uncover has been released. So yeah, definitely subscribe to stay updated and I will keep you updated once the uh, jailbreak is out or when we have new updates. And of course, thank you for watching. I am Geosnow and peace out.